Hey everyone, it's Will, and this week's topic is detransitioned. So what is detransitioning? Detransitioning is when somebody stops their gender transition and goes back to living as the gender that they lived as before transition. People detransition for different reasons. Some people detransition because they realize they were never really trans to begin with, and that transition was not the answer. Um, other people detransition because they can't safely uh, transition at that time and so they need to stop in order to maintain safety and then hopefully transition sometime in the future. Uh, those are the two reasons I've heard of. I don't know if there's others. If there are, I mean, would love to hear what they are. I find detransitioning actually very interesting. Um, I don't think that there's anything wrong with people who have detransitioned. I hope they can find happiness. I have nothing against people who have decided to detransition. However, some people, um, or a lot of people who do, seem to then take on this idea that nobody is trans and transition is not right for anyone. That I have a problem with, obviously. Um, transition was the best thing that I could have ever done for myself. Um, but I know that's not true for everyone. And yeah, overall, I feel like, you know, if you need to do transition, go do that for yourself. Find your happiness, whatever that may be. But don't say, oh, that means nobody can be happy transitioning. That means it's not right for anyone. And that means trans people don't exist because we do. And yeah, so that's my problem there. Now, part of this video is, have we ever considered detransitioning? And actually, yes, I did briefly consider stopping transition. Not because I didn't think that it was right for me, but because it was really tough when I first came out. I was 16, I was living at home, I was going to high school, and things at home were not great, and things at school were not great, and I just had this feeling of maybe I need to stop, and I need to go back to being who I was before, wait until I graduate, move away, be ready to cut all ties with my hometown and with my past, and start then, start fresh. Now, I'm really glad that I didn't do that because I don't think I mentally could have handled waiting those months, year and a half, two years, um, that I would have had to wait. So I'm really thankful because I told two friends about this one day, and I was really upset, and I was having a little bit of a breakdown, and I said to them, and I, you know, I was like, hey, I don't even know if this is worth it. Like, can I do this? Maybe I should give up. And they were like, well, if you do want to go back, like, that's fine, we'll support you, but do you really think you would be happy? And one of them said, you know, you've been more you these past few weeks than you have been in all the years I've known you. And that really rang true for me. I knew that I was making the right um, steps to be happy, but it was really hard because I was really concerned that people would... Um, never understand and that the next few years of my life would just be really difficult and they weren't easy but you know family came around I stopped caring as much about people at school people at school stopped caring as much about me you know became old news sort of thing and I'm really glad that I didn't go back because I don't think I mentally could have handled it so yeah if you're considering detransition I hope that you find your happiness out there um, you know, feel free to come talk to me if you want to, um, if you're having a hard time, if you're wondering your options. I mean, just because you started transition doesn't mean you can't stop. And I urge you, if you can, <laughs> find uh, any blogs or whatever on the internet of people who detransitioned, who don't take the idea that all trans people are, should detransition, and listen to them and talk to them and find support. If you are someone who has detransitioned, uh, I just hope you realize that it, what's right for you might not be right for everyone. Uh, that's all I have to say on this topic, which is actually quite a bit. This video is quite long. I will see you next week, and have a good week.